What is up everyone, Zario here, and welcome to yet another Tekken cosplay video. Yes, I know, I know, I know, I am doing a lot of these, but you guys seem to like them, so I don't see why, why I should stop. Plus, every time I look at the character customization items, I, I, I kind of get inspired to do another one, as DJ Khaled would say, another one. Um, but nevertheless, there are up to 22 videos. I don't think anybody has put as much time, not to too long horn, but nobody has, has put as much time into character cosplay and having fun with this as much as I have, or rather I have not seen so. But uh, shout out to everybody who's enjoying the videos, because I have a very, very special treat for you guys. Now, there have been past Tekken characters, many of which I am very big fans of, even though I didn't main them. I didn't main those characters. I, I, I'm, I was still a big fan of them. And they have not been present in past Tekken games, you know, in a while. As well as this one, at least for the time being. Now, they did announce that if, or rather when, they add the DLC characters, if any of them were... Tekken characters from past Tekken games, then those will be free. So I can only assume that some of those characters that we have not seen in Tekken in a while are going to be added to the roster later on down the line. With that being said, we are going to take inspiration from one of those characters who we have not seen in Tekken 7 yet, as well as a couple other past Tekken games. You know, we haven't seen this, the actual character in there. Quote unquote. And um, we're actually going to take inspiration from that character and we're going to do a cosplay with Ling Xiao Yu. And we're going to do two different versions of this character. One is going to be from Tekken 2 and the one is going to be from Tekken 6. Alright? And the character that I am going to be doing a cosplay of from a past Tekken game with Ling Xiao Yu is. Julia Chang. That's right. A lot of y'all like her. I do. She was, I, I liked her fighting style. I didn't really main her like I did Lee. You know what I'm saying? That's the main. But I like playing with Julia Chang. And with this customization, hopefully this will give you some hope that maybe they will add her later on. But until then, this is the closest thing that we got. So like I said, I'm going to do two different versions. The first one, is going to be her outfit that she had on in in Tekken 2. It's going to be inspired by that. So, first thing we need to get right is the hair. Now, obviously they don't have everything to make this a 100% accurate Tekken cosplay. But, I mean, like, like, an accurate cosplay, excuse me. But, I'm going to do the best I can with the options that they have available. Don't get mad at me because it doesn't look 100% like Julia Chan. I'm doing the best I can with what they have. Damn it. Okay. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to get this ponytail hairstyle. Julia did have some bangs. I think I have a color that can match this. Um, like a dark brown. Kind of already had it set from a past uh, cosplay idea that I had. And I don't think it's going to matter what this color is, what the color of the hair size is going to be, because it's going to put something in her hair, and I don't even think you're going to be able to notice what the hair tie color is. But we're going to do turquoise, because that's what she had on in Tekken 2. Next, we're going to get the outfit right. Now, this is a fairly simple. Now, remember, this is her Tekken 2. Um, outfit. Let me, see, let me see, did she have all gloves in Tekken 2? I think she did, but I have the picture, but I'm kind of just going off of memory. And she did. This is like the closest thing that we have, that they have in the game, to what she had in Tekken 2. So we're actually going to be using this for both outfits, actually. So this one... We gotta give her like a dark brown uh, jacket. 
in the dark brown jacket. Like that, I think it's on the ground, like the tag on the chair. Uh, not really, I don't really like that. I'm trying to really pull it out. Right? really like it. It's like it's going brighter, it's not gonna really match. It's more like a rusty, I wanna say like a, it's almost like a maroon color. Like a brownish maroon jacket. It's hard trying to get these colors accurate, so forgive me if I don't do it well, it's just constant. Um, the clothes, or what? Well, the shirt was. Like the shirt was kind of like this, but it was darker. Actually, it was lighter. And actually, one matter of fact, it was like a yellow. It was, it was like a white yellow. Like that right there. Almost like an eggshell white, kind of. Eggshell. Funny enough, I never really knew eggshell, eggshell white actually existed. We're gonna go right there. And then as well as, actually, I think we can get that from one of the default colors. Actually, it was just like this. Alright, good. So that's our second two style jacket look. And of course, she had on shorts, jean shorts, and, and she did have on boots and jean shorts, but unfortunately, since we don't have that option, we're going to have to rock with this. Jeans with Put that boot. Put that boot in. I don't know how to call this. Let's say they look like that. And we're going to give... You know, she didn't really have on a belt either, we don't need a belt brown. The, the boots, kind of the same color as the, as the jacket. Now, time to give her some pizzazz because we, we're missing that final piece. Oh, yeah. And since Julia Chung is Native American, um, why don't we just add some feathers like this? You know, I mean, technically she did have feathers in her in her hair in pretty much every Tekken game. But they don't really have the ones that just, you know, are at the side. So, give them what they have. Like I said, it wasn't going to be accurate, so damn it, don't get mad at me. Um, I also want to give her something else, though. I want to give her something else. I don't know what. I want to give her something else. I don't know what, not this, obviously not, but, um, just something extra, like, I feel like it's missing something, kind of like, what's it was, and, matter of fact, yeah, let's, well, shit, I can't do that, can I? That's a hell no right there. Actually, actually what she got on right now ain't bad. So we can just leave it right here. We leave our other makeup off. So, so this is her Tekken 2 outfit. Let's see if we can get a good, good picture. Oh, there we go. Right there. For whatever reason, that just spells out Julia Chung for whatever reason. So that was her Tekken... That was the Tekken, uh... 2 inspired outfit. Now we're gonna do her Tekken 6 inspired outfit. Now, in Tekken 6, she... She had on... A... Training bra, and it was another, like, kind of like a tank... Kind of like a bra-like top. On top of that, but since we don't have that option, we're gonna reuse the same um, 
formula for the top, unfortunately. So they didn't really change her clothes up that much. But about what she had in Tekken 6, you can't really emulate that because we don't have that top in Tekken 7. So I'm going to... I want to say this is it, nah. Literally, this is the closest thing right here. This is the closest thing. I'm going to just rock with that again. Now, what I'm going to do is, the top bra that she has on, and, and the bra that she has on underneath it. I'm going to, the one that's underneath it, I'm going to change that to the t-shirt color in this. And then the jacket is going to be the color of that bra that she has on over it. So that's how we're going to do this. I actually got it. No, I'm not bad. Oh. Maybe blue. I know I got that blue color somewhere. Oh. Maybe it should look different because of what what of the way the jacket looks. Alright, so we're gonna um, I'm gonna go with the green. Go there. Actually, I'm is what I want to do. Feels like this goes dark. I'm almost like that. That's actually perfect. And then her... The bar that she had on over it was... It was like a light brown. So, Kind of like this, but slightly darker. Come on. This is gonna be a hard time, huh? Kind of like, yeah, right here. Right here. Oh. Right. And we got. Gloves, which were a dark brown. Where's the brown at? TV that's kind of messing me up a little bit, but it's definitely this is honestly this is the closest we have color that we want to get. Actually, this is it right here. So we're gonna let's see, just gonna rock with that. Of course, the bottom ought to be ought to be the obvious part. The down. This is her. This is Julia. Chen. If people didn't see this and think of Julia Chen then you're really not a fan of Tekken because this is just, that's like the trademark outfit right there. But Tekken, Tekken was, uh, like the denim was blue. So, main part was to the point where they look stonewashed. That's it right there. Got that. So now, two strings. Ah, uh, we don't really. Let's turn them white, because I don't think she has a hot pattern. What about the bottom of the shoes and all that? We don't really care for that. We'll do that. Oh well. There we go. That's fine. 
it's definitely right. There we go. That's actually pretty good. Only down. Oh, and we're missing the headpiece. All right, we're good. Oh, and we didn't change your hair color. That's what we forgot. Who wants to do that? Oh, yeah. That right there is who the trans inspired. we're gonna get unless they actually put her in the game this is the closest we're gonna get to having a character look exactly like Julia Chung the only way you're gonna get closer than that is if they make Julia Chung herself Try giving her a tan, but nah, that's not Julia Chung at all. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like we can give her like a little accent, something on her face to make her. If not, I could just add it later on. I could do it. Like it's Julia Chung, but it's Ling Shao Yu. It's you know Ling Shao Yu is kind of playful, so this could probably actually work right there. Just a little something. Just a little something. Add that Ling Shao you in for. That's going to the second slot. Ladies and gentlemen, that is Ling Shao Yu as Julia Chung from Tekken 2 and Tekken 6. 